What's going on guys? My name is Jericho and right now I've got something big to show you. Now, uh, I've got something big to announce as well and uh, you're going to have to pardon my disgustingly messy room because the big thing that I'm going to show you is my new PC. Boom! And the reason my room is so disgusting is because I am moving. And that is right. Uh, Sonia and I are in the process of packing up the house because we are going to be moving up to Portland, Oregon. Um, there's a lot of reasons for that. It'll come in another video. I just thought I'd mention it. We tried to keep it kind of on the down low as much as possible just because uh, we weren't really sure if we were going to actually move or if things were going to go through with the house we were going to rent. So uh, it's official. We are moving. And uh, I'm sorry for the mess. I mean, it is disgusting. But you get some grizz over here. So look at this thing. Origin, uh, if you guys didn't know, I partnered up with Origin. They make uh, custom PC, custom built PCs. And uh, I needed a new one, not just because my old one was out of spec for uh, recording in 1080p, 60fps, but also because I was having a lot of blue screen and death issues. I think there was an issue with my power supply because I was having um, trouble. I was having trouble running multiple programs at once. It wasn't RAM because I did a memory test. I had this like little tuft of hair out and it's bugging me because it's just like, sup, bro? Um, you know what? Ugh. How do you like that? Uh, it basically I had a lot of issues with it and uh, I eventually tried to sort it out couldn't um, you know I went through all the basic steps reseated the whole computer it kind of sort of works now but it's not that good so now I gotta open this motherfucker they shipped it up look how big it is there's Grizz for reference okay it's 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 two guys had to carry this in it says over 70 pounds I don't know if you see this so I'm gonna like try to try to do this with one hand Wait, what if I, do I just, shit. What if I, do I just pry, oh, I gotta pry it. Here we go, here we go, just, just really. It actually has very important cautionary steps to unbox it. So, here we go, boys, without further ado. Oh, yeah! That's a big old box, what is this? It's a poster to how to set up things. Side door removal, remove insta, Oh my god, look at that. They took care of me. Look at this. They even have all the... Oh, here's what I'm excited for. They actually, all of their PCs come with, a, uh, come with LED panels that you can do all of these effects with. So it lights up in there. And that's going to be sexy. Here it is. Shit. I got to remove the top, don't I? I can't just slide it out. Oh, uh, <laughs> I hate these screws. They're big screws too. You know what's funny? I'm basically unboxing this for like a month until I put it back in this box. Uh, what did they give me? Oh, sweet. So we got a t-shirt. We got a t-shirt. Origin, thank you guys. That's nice of you. And a box that has all the cables and stuff in it. Nice. And look at all these. How many wrists do you think I have, Origin? Huh? Like 90? No, that's awesome. Thank you guys. So this is it, huh? Oh, they cover- it's got like- oh my god. This shit's dressed better than I am. It's like an underarm foam wrap. Holy shit. Uh, all right, I gotta put the camera down. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Seriously. No, seriously. This thing is actually, like, dressed better than me. It's, I don't, this is the first time I've ever seen a computer case wearing, like, Under Armour casing. That's fucking sick. All right, team, are we ready to see what's under the cover? Oh, oh, it's on there tight. Oh, it's in there tight. Oh, yeah. Look at this, baby. We, ow, shit. All right, you know, before I even open up the inside, I'm gonna have to de-static and wear myself one of my grounding bracelets, but look at the case. Oh, you so pretty. It looks so handsome. Shh, you're with daddy now. And the interior, I'll show you guys that in a second, but yeah, I gotta, gotta remove packaging. Don't worry about how I got that Avermedia in there, okay? Just know that it's in there and it's feeling good and it's doing its job. I also found out that I can use a PCIe slot I, uh, for a, an alternate capture card, so I'm going to throw the HD60 in there. I've never had a computer with only one PCI slot, so I didn't know that. Um, another thing I didn't know, and maybe you guys will laugh at me for this, um, back here, this is the Titan X on the back, you can see it's got one DVI port, or, or uh, one DVI port and one HDMI and three other ports. Didn't know those other three ports were, uh, for 144 hertz monitors, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of those so I can play Counter-Strike at 144 hertz. Hello, global. Now that we got all that out of the way, um, what's the internals look like? We have ourselves a Monster i7, uh, 59, 5960X, 
at 3.75 gigahertz. It's going to be amazing. Eight cores of sexuality. We have 32 gigabytes of RAM, um, DDR4 RAM at that. Uh, and the Origin Frostbite Cooler, liquid cooling, is going to be so God damn cool in this thing. It's going to be amazing. Uh, obviously the Titan X. Between the 32 gigs of RAM and the Titan X, I should be set for every video file I ever need to render, which is every day, always. So I'm already getting moist thinking about my render times with this beast of a machine and Adobe Premiere. And then um, the AverMedia, I took that out of my computer. Like I mentioned, uh, HD60 Pro will go in right here, one of those PCIe's. 1,000 uh, watt power supply, EVGA uh, Supernova, I believe. Yeah, it actually says it right there. Good talk, Tucker. Um, inside here we got, it's hard to see, but this is a, um, uh, a one terabyte SSD. Samsung SSD for the OS as well as games and programs, and then a four terabyte HDD for all of the files. And that wraps up the internals. This thing is a monster and I am so ready to plug it in. Let's get this bitch on the road. All right, here we go. The moment of truth, power button, focus. Shit. There it is, ladies and gentlemen, please focus. Oh, oh, it's a party. Woo, look at all those fucking lights. That's not a bit distracting. I feel like I'm in Japan. I am ready for this. I'm going to make this sync up with my Razer keyboard. That's gonna look awesome. Um, there we go, it's up, it's working, it's uh, it's doing just fine, it looks like. It already went to, it already went to the, it already pushed to my screen, so I was just making sure it wasn't doing anything funky, but look at this. This is awesome. This really is, this really is honestly the best computer I could have asked for. And uh, I'm super excited. It should be able to bring up the quality of the streams a lot for you guys. That, to me, is the biggest reason to get it because now I'll be able to record in 1080 60fps while playing in 1080 60fps. Just kind of got to wait on Twitch to up their bitrate for that. <clears throat> Twitch. So anyways, guys, check out this lovely piece of machinery thank you guys at origin for sending this over so there you guys have it that is the new pc i know that a lot of people are probably going to be asking the question like why didn't you build your own or something to that effect or what are you doing with your old pc um why didn't i build my own because i bought my last four pcs no my last three pcs i built um each one of them was definitely an experience the first one took a couple days uh, cause I had never done it before. I mean, eventually I got it down to like three or four hours after troubleshooting, but the time, effort, and pain that you save yourself from not building your PC is sometimes worth even more than the like 250 bucks you save from having somebody else bid it, build it. Like, uh, second time I built my PC, forgot the standoffs, fried the motherboard. Could have fried the CPU too. Um, third time, uh, I had the defective, I did, I had a defective motherboard, so I had to send that back and it took an extra two weeks. And it's just like, you know, at that point, you really don't want to deal with it. So um, they stress test, the uh, Origin stress test that PC before they sent it to me. So there shouldn't be any problems with it. And uh, overall, I mean, that's just big for me as a content creator. It's less days off. It means that I only have to spend like one day setting it up instead of like three days switching back and forth and figuring out what's wrong. So um, that's probably the biggest reason why I decided to, uh, to not have a... Uh, uh, not build my own PC this time. Anyways, uh, again, just wanted to thank Origin for hooking it up. My old PC, I'm gonna be transferring to a mid case if I can fit one. Uh, if not, I'll just put it in a, I'll put it in a new full case, reseat everything, uh, wipe it, and then um, use it as a living room setup. So I'll be able to use like, I'll install a Wi-Fi uh, adapter as well as um, uh, Bluetooth. So I'll be able to do like YouTube videos and stuff from the living room. Uh, of the new house, which I'm just super excited to be moving into. So, uh, there's been a couple days where we've not been streaming often, or, well, Sonya and I have not been streaming, or it's been super late, or we've been really hush-hush about it. Honestly, it's been all packing for the move. I mean, look at this place. I'm not wearing any pants. You just got a little bit of dick right there. Not really, just, you know. Uh, it's just disgusting. Getting set up for a move is a real pain in the ass. And uh, I did not know how much of a pain, so bear with us for the next couple weeks, guys, if we're off and on with streams. It's just really hard to manage all this stuff while doing daily uh, content. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, let me know, like, and a comment. Go shout out to, uh, wow, go thank Origin for hooking it up. Hopefully bringing you guys some better stream quality, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later.